Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel, Doss here, and welcome back to this League of Legends reaction. So I'm going to be reacting to the opening ceremony for Worlds 2020. I'm pretty sure KDA is performing because I saw one of the artists wear a motion capture suit, and that usually indicates they're going to be performing KDA. So, uh, I'm super excited for what's going to be shown. Usually League of Legends knocks it out of the park for the opening ceremony, so this should be fun. Without further ado get into that reaction shall we all right here we go opening ceremony presented by mastercard world 2020 final let's get into it. all right China may not be the birthplace of esports, but some say the country has become its home. I mean, you guys have been horrible to VTubers, so... Oh, there's people behind me. It's here that the game continues to evolve. Year after year, a new style rises, built from the lessons of masters. Oh, that looks pretty cool. Pink of play, 10 years in the making is here, right now. This is World 2020. It's time to take over. 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, 0. Alright, let's do this, boys and girls. Alright, games. Is there captions? No, there's not captions. Damn. Oh, wait. Oh, this is Chinese of... Yeah, this is Chinese pop stars. Huh. On your level. Yeah, this is Chinese pop stars. Oh, you can see Seraphine in the background. This is pretty cool. Oh! Macaulay. Oh, that's pretty sick. Yeah! Here we go. Oh, that's so cool. Dude, this is so good. Alright, I think I can hire the volume a bit. I've been listening to this non stop for this past week. We don't get- we're not getting good lighting on her, though. Evelyn, my queen! Oh, there's Ari. Looks kind of weird. Looks more like Stella Chu. Oh, Jesus. Looks kind of fuzzy as well. Uh, the models look a little weird. Like, the faces are really weird. Are they supposed to look like they're actual singers? Oh, dance moves. Okay. Yeah, this looks a little janky. Evelyn, my queen. Yeah, they definitely made them look like they're singers in the face. That's pretty cool. All I ever know 
is life upon the throne. Yeah, they look a little fuzzy and a little weird with the more human-like faces. I, I prefer the pop stars one so far. Yeah, they definitely use the real faces. You can see it in Kaiza. Okay, here comes Seraphine. I believe those are the same singers. Yeah, they definitely use real faces. So, oh, Seraphine looks really weird. Still a good song though. They're just so blurry. I mean, it was a good song. The models look like, look at Seraphine. She looks really weird with. Her voice actress's face. I don't know. I don't know about that. <gasps> oh my god. Okay, so we got Katie and now we got Sins Never Die. Ah, to show off the players, maybe. Look at her. She looks so beautiful. And now your name. Legends never die. The stage looks sick. Oh, that's cool. That's a cool effect. Whoa. Six feet apart, even for the dancers. Oh, really? Here we go. Rise, dude. To the world, no heroes or villains. Welcome to the world, the only begun. So, pick up your weapon and face us. That's a little cringe. The choreography is a bit cringe. <laughs> All right. Rise, rise. It's one of my favorite songs for the videos. Choreography is really cringe, though. This video gave me chills when I saw it, so. Oh, they're mixing both. That sounds freaky. I like that. 
This guy's dancing is really nice. I like this. That sounds so cool, having both versions playing at the same time. Oh, this is giving me chills. This part's giving me chills. This part's sick. We are, don't turn away now. We are the warrior. The drums! Although I think Louis Vuitton made this one again, right? This is cool. It's a cool mix. That's so good. Here in the rise background as well. It's so good. Oh, this is this is good. This is really nice. That was that was good. That was good. Uh we've got four three more minutes. Four three more minutes. Hey! Look at that drumline. I wasn't part of drumline, but Ah, uh, his drum is broken. That's a shame. Ooh. It's a shame that his drum's broken. Oh, they fixed it now. I don't think I heard this song before. Was this some a music video I hadn't seen? Ooh. Dude, that live uh, drum line is really good with this. Yeah, his drum's still broken. That's a shame. Now it's fixed. Oh, that's a cool effect. Ooh. Damn, I'm gonna have this. I've had this to my playlist. Damn. Visuals are really good right here. Hot oh, damn. Ooh, that was cool. Ooh, I like this. I like the this intro to the players. Damn, this is a beat, dude. With that drum line. Ooh. It snaps, dude. Dude, this song slaps. Dude, that drum line is doing a fantastic job. Ooh, that's cool. Ooh, that's pretty sick. That's a cool visual. That's a really cool visual. Here we go. The trophy. That's always a cool effect, having that open up. Ooh. Oh, damn. That looks cool. That's cool. Cover your nose, dude. Oh, Jesus. Hey, it's Josh. That's my buddy. He voices Galileo. Good for you, Josh. That looks pretty cool. 
Still a little fuzzy, but that looks pretty cool. That looks pretty cool. That was cool. That was a really cool way to end. Clipping through that bit, but... Oh, okay. Nice. That was good. That was really good. Oh, that's it. All right. Uh, on to my, uh, my thoughts. All right. So my thoughts on the show. Um, the KDA portion, the music was great. I, it was interesting to hear a, a Chinese version of, uh, pop stars, but the models looked horrible. Like not only were they really fuzzy and like, like it kind of looks like, like if it was on a really bad green screen. Uh, but they replaced the faces of the of the characters with the faces of the actual singers. So like you had Soyoung and uh, I think it was Mion. Uh, their faces were replaced with, with uh, on Akali and on Ari, and then you had Madison and Jaira replaced on um, Evelyn and Kaiza, and then you had um, what's her face, a new girl who's voicing Seraphine. Her uh, like you had Seraphine's face replaced with hers. I thought that looked horrible. That looked really bad. Like, they looked so weird. They looked really uncanny. Like, and with how, like, the characters are, are built, they don't really work all that. I think the ones that worked the best were Ari and Evelyn. I think the faces worked the best with them. But with Akali, it looked really weird. And then, especially on Seraphine and Kaiza, it looked really, really bad. Like, the faces just didn't work. So that that's a shame. That That's, that's what I was really looking forward to in Hyper. I want to see... I want to see. I want to look at the comments in this video. I want someone put? I love how in the music video they fo they focus on Evelyn's yellow eyes, just to make them blue in this. Yeah, it is notable that the quality of the event was lower. However, due to the situation, I think it is better than we could expect. I really think I really think congratulate the people right who work in these conditions. I hope that next year things will normalize. Yeah, I I will say uh with the with the whole pandemic and everything this is pro they've probably screwed up everything for them which is probably why the quality was a lot lower than what it usually is because if you look at the pop stars video two years ago or the true damage one last year and you compare it to this you can tell like just the characters alone it looked a lot worse like if you compare um here i'll try to put it on screen right now if you compare the kda girls from from pop stars uh actually let's put it right here from the KDA girls from Pop Stars during the live event, and then the KDA girls now with uh with more 2020, you can see a difference, and that's not what you want. Um, the visuals throughout, like just the regular song parts, were really dope. The chore the choreography for the fighting was pretty bad. I'm gonna be honest. Um, I've done I've done choreography fighting before. I have a little bit of experience with that but like this was just I, I understand it's also with dancing and stuff like that and there's stuff that they did that i wouldn't be able to do but like there was a lot of portions in that choreography that was just kind of rough it didn't really work out oh yeah so another comment put right here my doctor prosthetic grandma akali ain't real she can't hurt you prosthetic grandma akali yeah it might not be the best opening yet i truly appreciate the effort that the entire team must have gone through to deliver it Taking into consideration the whole pandemic situation, believe me, as much as we think that could have been better, they are dying from the inside, wishing they have delivered better. Good luck next. Year. Good luck for next year. Much love. Yeah, yeah. A lot of people are complaining about the quality, um, and we all agree. We all understand that this pandemic really screwed everything up. It really screwed it up so bad. And I'm pretty sure the team that has worked on this feels the same exact way. They're not happy with the quality. They think it's not the best. There's not much you can do. Um, besides that, there are some technical difficulties, like with the, with, with the drum line, the main drum line, one of, one of the guy's drums wasn't lighting up. Um, that's a shame. That's, it's probably, that just was a malfunction. Nothing they could have really done. So that does suck. Um, kind of ruined the whole look a bit, but, oh, well, there's not much you can do. Um, it's only just, there's only so much you can do when it comes to tech like that. Um, however, the whole like screens and stuff, like the the stuff going on the screens and the actual stage looked really cool. And then the transitions showing the players, that was sick, especially going with the beat of the song and the drum line. 
that was really, really crisp and clean. That was good. And the ending song, really dope. And I love the mix between the two different um, uh, Legends Never Die, I think it was. No, no, it was, um, what was it called? Uh, what's that song called? The, um, the Work While They All Play. Hold on. I, I know the name. It's, uh, okay, so it was work. It is work. Um, the mix between the two, the, the original and then the, the, the 2020, uh, season 2020 version, that was really, really good. Like, I love the, the sounds of that. They did it really well. And then they also mixed, um, in like all the songs that have come out in the last like year. That was really, really good. That was, that was, that felt really but that last song was really good. I don't know if that was for a music video or something that came out with, with League that I just didn't watch. Uh, let me know in the comments if that's the case. But overall, this was a pretty good opening ceremony. It obviously wasn't better than the last like three years. But with everything that's gone on, I can't blame the quality for being shittier. So, yeah. I will say it was nice to see, uh, what was his name, Galio come down from the heavens and... and do that. I'm glad that my buddy's character is it, it gets so much love in League of Legends. I'm so happy because um, like not a lot of people really enjoy Roadhog, and not a lot of people play Paladins and like Terminus. So it's good that his League of Legends character gets love. So, so that's really um. But yeah, those are my thoughts on this video on on the opening ceremony. Obviously, it could have been better. Obviously, the team that worked on everything knows it could have been better, but. They did what they could with, with how the world is, and hopefully next year things normalize so that they can come back soon and come back hard. Um, yeah, I'm looking forward to it. Uh, I will be reacting to next year's opening ceremony because the opening ceremonies are always really cool. I hate League of Legends. I don't like watching it. I don't like playing it. But the music that they make for it and they have for it and the visuals are always so good, so well made. So we'll go ahead and see. But anyways, guys, if you liked the video and you liked my reaction to it and my thoughts given to this, leave a like down below. I do react to KDA stuff every now and again. If there's any more League of Legends stuff you want me to react to, please tell me in the comments below. I have already watched quite a bit of like the older stuff, but the stuff that has come out in the last like month or two that has been KDA, I have not seen. Um, and there's some old stuff that I haven't seen as well. So by all means, if there's any other League of Legends content you want me to react to, let me know down in the comments. Um, if you aren't, uh, already in this community, why not join it? Hit that subscribe button, love to have you. Uh, I react to other stuff like Ruby, and in the near future, I'll be reacting to other series, probably Stranger Things and other anime and stuff like that. And uh, ring the bell so you get notified whenever a new video goes live. Anyway, uh, recording this Halloween is probably going to go up some some point today on Halloween. Uh, so, happy Halloween, guys. Stay safe. Love you guys. And as always, have a good morning, afternoon. Anyway, bye everyone.